when you have trust and you have domestic violence. The domestic violence ends up breaking the trust. Once you break the trust, it will leave a person vulnerable to having violence come to them again or leave them to where they're vulnerable to other things. And in false pretense, you saw quite a bit of it, whether it was the trust that was lost in a relationship between a man and a woman or the trust that was lost between a mother and a child. And in all three characters, you found that all of them became vulnerable in one or another way, whether it was finding the trust that they felt like they lost in the person they were connected to, finding it in someone else and then someone else using them because they saw that they were vulnerable. And in domestic violence, you see that often because once the trust is gone and a lot of times the self-esteem is broken, people have a tendency of looking for trust and love again in some places. It's human instinct to want to be loved. And when that instinct kick in, sometimes you leave yourself vulnerable to less than you deserve. As, as a human being. And you saw that, for instance, in the character of Sydney, she found herself to be vulnerable and wanting to be loved, that she found it in different relationships, that she became vulnerable and e an easy target for men because they could see it in her early on. And then in Dion, she became vulnerable, but she tried to put up a wall where she didn't let her vulnerability show, but it, it was still there underlying. And then in Meredith, she became vulnerable because what she thought was going on in her marriage, which may have stemmed from early childhood mistrust, then she found herself almost slipping into being an easy target for someone else.